Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome to Gaming Tech. In today's video, I am going to give you a quick unboxing of the Lenovo K5 Plus 3GB RAM variant, which was launched in late 2K16. So, this smartphone is available online at a price of just 8.5K INR, which is equal to 131.5 US dollars. This is the box here, having Lenovo service and warranty assured sticker on top. There's the Lenovo logo and the model number. On the back panel of the box, all the necessary details are provided including the SAR values. So this phone here sports Snapdragon Octa-Core processor, Dolby Atmos speakers and premier aluminum casing. It runs on Android 5.1 that is Lollipop which is confirmed to be upgraded to Marshmallow soon which I'll talk later in this video. It has Snapdragon 6, 616 Octa-Core processor at 1.5 GHz clock speed at max. It has a full HD screen with 441 PPI that is pixels per inch and it has a 30 megapixel primary camera and 5 megapixel secondary camera with single flash and a 2750 mAh removable battery. So let us start the unboxing. Here I will have the box which contains the phone. Let's open it. So this is the phone. It has the protective layer on the top. I have here the golden version of the Lenovo YK Fitness and it really feels Comfortable in hands, really smooth and silky. It, it looks also very cool. So let us keep it aside and open the box. So here we have the box. This is the top layer in which the phone was there. Let's open it. Okay, on the first top layer we have some paperwork. Here we have the Lenovo White Key Effect Plus Quick Start Guide and some other papers including uh, warranty. This is the Quick Start Guide, it shows all the basic details. This is the Le Lenovo Limited Warranty. And this is some more information about the product. So let us keep it aside and check other things. We are provided with the USB cable and there is the USB adapter. Let's open it. This adapter is the USB 2 plus uh, which supports 1.5 ampere charging this is not, not a basically quick charge but we can use quick chargers so this was it no headphones provided in the box that's really sad to know but to, in today's phones uh, they don't provide the headphones that's alright now let's come back to the phone K5 Plus which has the protective coating on the top which I'll just take it out and here's the screen Lenovo did not mention that it is a dragon tail or a gorilla glass but it's a scratch proof screen but I still use uh, advise users to use tempered glass and on the top we have the proximity sensor the 5MP 720p camera and the earpiece and at the bottom we have the three capacitive buttons which are not backlit and it's a problem for users who use their phone in the dark but overall it's good and switching on the back panel we have the 13 megapixel camera on top with single flash and the primary speed, uh, mic and that's the Lenovo branding and the bottom support, there is the Dolby dual speakers they are really pretty good and at this price range they're definitely a good thing and there's the primary mic. The body is made up of aluminum which is 
which has a great appearance uh, but it is prone to scratches so I ad advise the users to use body cover. There's the 3.5 mm audio jack on the top and the USB 2.0 slot. On the right we have the volume and power buttons and nothing on the left. So overall this phone is good for people who use who used to listen to songs, play music and play mobile games because heavy gaming drains the battery and my overall review uh, about the pros and cons will be on the next video so please guys like and subscribe to the video and comment what you have to ask about this phone I'll answer them quickly well before ending this video I would like to talk about the Android update about the smartphone which most of you might be waiting to hear Lenovo officially announced the Marshmallow update for this device on March this year but if you notice clearly, this update was only mentioned for selected countries which did not include India. Now the question arises, what about India? Well, to be honest, no one exactly knows what Lenovo is planning. But according to me, I think Lenovo will launch this update in India later this year for sure, as the Android Marshmallow update, which has already begun to be rolled out in foreign countries, has no Volti feature enabled in it. And the in Indian update will surely include the Volti feature as many of the Indian models support Volti. So till then we have to wait for the further data from Lenovo and we can refer to the Android upgrade matrix available on Lenovo's official site. So that's about it guys. Thanks for watching the video again and please like and subscribe my channel. So once again, welcome to Gaming Tech.